hello everyone so this is how they take the bride to her husband's house now after the event the husband has gone now they take the bride room by room for her to be prayed on they will say her goodbyes her mother is praying for her right now you know it's just very emotional and then you just be crying literally i cried like plenty plenty times but tears did not drop she tears just got in my eye and i'm like maria man up you're the person that is filming this video anyway her mother was praying for her and then her grandma too also prayed for her you know she just basically say goodbye to her family members that um are in that compound so yeah this was us waiting for the bride and here she comes this is her life her like a goodbye from the house usually she's escorted by aunties you know who take her to the husband's house now the friends of the husband and the husband is outside like they've come to pick her up it's different cars so friends family and this is us on our way to the house i wanted to follow this thing like to the latter because i wanted to see how it will end it will just usually go in a convoy now she has arrived in her in-laws house some people just take directly to the husband's house but here they are taking her straight to the in-laws house first and you guys they welcomed her hey her in-laws are ouchy okay they are muslims and then they're from edo state so they danced they were happy this was us just trying to enter into the building you know it was such a warm reception and they danced you guys ha huh? i'm going to do an extensive video on how like the edo people welcomed their bride because this one it blew my mind away honestly Like I said, it was plenty, plenty diamonds and a finish line. Oh. Anyway, it was time for us to move and then we because that room was too small, we now moved to the parlor and this is a crowd like friends, family, the relatives, her illos were still dancing like dancing up to this point and this is me with my oily face my makeup from morning i was excited i was not even tired and we we're waiting for them to start so i was just uh, i said let me show you guys this henna me i couldn't do henna because i didn't come a day to the wedding i i, I arrived there they were doing her henna so yeah they welcomed us with some drinks and they kept dancing i think when I, they danced for almost an hour i'm not joking and then they brought the bride to come and sit in the middle and then they will now welcome her the way Aochi people welcome their bride. I don't know if this is peculiar to the Aochi Muslims. Aochi, Aochi from Edo State are Muslim Muslims. So yeah, this is her and then they will bring in these plates. I'll do an extensive video basically but this was like the introduction of um the parents, her in-laws, the in-laws were greeting her with some cash, you know so this was the time when her friends and family were just saying goodbye to her um so some of us the selected friends were still i don't know behind coincidentally Sha, it wasn't planned but this is like the very final time that her family would just wish her goodbye and her friends not be saying i die but like bye bye we have left you here you know you're, you have come to your new home your in-laws will take care of you and all of that apparently we were supposed to follow her to the groom's place but no usually her mother would not follow for this kind of event her mother's friends or sisters would go instead so yeah we have now arrived at her new home even before she arrived herself so this is her parlor i would ask her to do like an extensive um, parlor video for us if she would permit us but yeah this is her coming in apparently she's supposed to come into her right foot and say a few prayers islamically i know that is what is done you know and then say ah, this this bride a ginger bride amina me as me if i was amina i would be way like oh but amina did not cry I mean, I was just smiling at some point. So this is her in-law, the woman who like received her. Two of them were the ones that escorted her, basically. And then they took her to her bedroom where she sat. Apparently, they're saying she's supposed to sit because she's supposed to have her own personal room. So I think she was supposed to go to her personal room, but they brought her shower to her husband's room, and this is her just sitting down and receiving advice. It was such a beautiful event, honestly. Like different people saying different things to her, praying for her, wishing her well. Christians don't do that kind of thing. I just wish that there was like something like this. Because it, it just like it just makes you feel like loved, even to your husband's house. And 
advice just kept rolling in and prayers and this was us saying goodbye some of our ab friends we have not met since after graduation but i mean i'm such a lovely person so we all came from different places some from gombe bauchi different places abuja and just you know to enjoy this moment and this girl was still teasing me <laughs> <laughs> yeah,